Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can track phone number clicks from your website with uh, Google Tag Manager and Google Analytics. So a lot of you have been asking what happens if some of your clients actually click on the phone number displayed on your website and how you can track this. So apart from tracking actual calls, you also want to see how many of those are actually clicking. Um, you can easily do this um, with a few clicks in Google Tag Manager and Google Analytics. So let's jump right into it. Um, you'll need access to your Google um, Tag Manager account. And what you want to do here is head over to Tags. And then create a new tag, which you will call um, Event Phone Number Click. Under Tag Configuration, choose Google Analytics, and then choose Google Analytics GA4 Event. Now, Google Analytics makes it easy for you. You just need your measurement ID, the Google Analytics um, account, as this here under Admin, Data Streams, click on your data stream, and then simply copy this measurement ID. Head back to Google Tag Manager and paste this. Now, I haven't configured a Google Tag container, but you can either create one or if you've already set up, this will work um, just fine. And then you can just simply choose the name of the event. So that would be, that needs to be in lowercase without any spaces. So I would go with phone click, just keep it simple. Now, you do have the option to send additional parameters with along with the uh, event that will be sent to Google Analytics for. Um, for instance, you could click on the value here and then um, shoot over the click URL and name this click URL and also add another parameter, click on this. If you're not finding these, click on built-ins and then here you can find the click URL um, and maybe you also want to send the click text, right? Know exactly which number was called. So you can also name this click text as an additional parameter in um, Tag Manager. Um, next thing you want to do, of course, I can hit save here and add a trigger. I need to add a trigger here, um, and the trigger would be a new trigger. So I click on new, name the trigger, uh, and click. on the trigger configuration. And what you're looking for here is click on the just links. Just links and then I uh, you want this trigger to fire on some link clicks when the click URL starts with tell underscore um tell um uh, these two dots here. And and this is because if you click on inspect here on the number, you'll see that um, typically these numbers that are uh, clickable um, start with um, uh, the tell option here. So heading back to Google Tag Manager, save this. Now you have your tag ready along with the trigger. Click on save. And then you can either preview or hit submit. And once you hit submit and you've deployed this on your website, if people start clicking on this, then eventually you'll end up in Google Analytics 4 um, with events here. Again, this is a, um, an empty account, but under events, you'll start seeing the event we just created here in Tag Manager, phone number click, right? So once you find that event, um, everything becomes really, really easy with the reports because you can segment with the phone number clicks. Again, we're passing additional parameters like the click text and the click URL, so everything is trackable.